Hey everybody, Scott here. In this short video, I'd like to do something called the GPA game. And in this game, we're going to assume that a student has taken six classes. They have two Bs and four Cs. Their GPA is a 2.33, and they would like to get on the Dean's List, and that requires a 3.5 GPA. They'd also like to get into a program next year, and it requires a high GPA, so they need to raise their GPA up a little bit. Let's assume, for instance, that all classes are three credit classes. It just makes it easier. And before I go any further, I'd also like to note that I'm not saying the grades are the most important thing in the world. Of course they're not, but sometimes you need a good GPA to do the things you want to do in school. So my question to you is, how many A's will a student need to get to get their GPA from a 2.33 up to a 3.5. Just think about that for one second. And then I'll go through and I'll start adding classes, all straight A's, and see how many it takes. You got that in your head? Okay, well let's start adding classes here and see what we have. And by the way, you can do this as well. Just go to Google, type in GPA calculator, find the calculator, and then just put in the grade and the number of credits. You'll need to do both. And you can see how the GPA just went up there a little bit. Let's add another class. They're doing pretty good. Okay, it's probably not going to take too many, right? It's two classes. I need to keep track of this. Let's add another class. Straight A's, we're assuming straight A's. Looking pretty good. Here's four classes. All right, now their GPA is a 3.0. Okay, so how many is it going to take to get up to a 3.5? Let's check it out. I'm going to speed up the video just a little bit so you can see how this works. Okay, well, if you're following along, you can see that this student has had to get straight A's, 12 straight A's, to get their GP up to a 3.44. Let's see how many more classes it takes to get up to their desired 3.5. Not yet. Okay, here we are. This student would have had to earn 14 A's all three credit classes to get that GP up to a 3.5. My point here is obviously that once your GPA is lower than you desire, it's really difficult to move it a lot higher. You can start moving it a little bit higher, but because there's so many classes, the numbers just don't go up that quickly. So please think about the GPA that you'll want to have for your programs, for your life, for your self-esteem, whatever it might be. Because sometimes if you dig yourself a hole, it can be really difficult to dig your way out of that hole. Best of luck, everybody.